Welcome back to Mechanical Pros. Today we're going to talk about how to make a flare and how to check that it's correct for a copper pipe for HVAC. First thing I want to show you is a piece of copper. I just cut this off a, a line set that we only used part of. It still has the factory flare on it. Even though it's a factory flare, we like to cut it off and, uh, and flare it ourselves and use the flare nut that came with the piece of equipment. So I'll have my flare tool gauge right here and I'm going to check this factory flare. It should fit within this hole, but not go through it. It's got to stop, so it makes sure that it's the right size. As you can see, it goes straight through. And then if you were to look at this copper, you can see that it wasn't deburred before they, they made this flare. You've got jagged edges all the way around it. So what we'll do is we'll cut this flare off and we'll reflare it, we'll check it with our, we'll deburr it, we'll recheck it with our flare tool when we're done, and then we'll talk about um, sealing it onto the unit. Just going to cut it off. You'd cut it to the length you needed um, for whatever install you're doing. So now we've got this piece of copper that has this raw edge on it from where we cut it off. So we're going to deburr the, the piece of copper. Just take and run the deburring tool around it a few times and you can see the little bit of shavings it takes off. So now we take the flare nut that came on the unit that we're going to attach the copper to, put it over the copper before we put the flare tool on. So this flare tool has a guide depth and you want to make sure that you uh, push your copper all the way up to it and you'll get the pro should get the proper flare. So we're there, we'll tighten the tool on, slide it out of the way, that'll hold your copper in. And then you're going to flare until your uh, clutch breaks. So there's the clutch, release it. All right, so our new flare is made. We made sure our nut was on first. Now we're gonna check it with our flare gauge. Push it in, it goes in, it doesn't go through. So we have a good flare, right? So that's, that's making a flare. All right, so we've made our flare, we've checked it, everything's good. Let's just real quick talk about what not to do when going to hook this to the unit. So you're going to hook this to the unit and there's going to be some threads where this goes on, this nut. Some people think that you should put thread tape or pipe dope, any of that. Nothing like that goes on there. You just need to put the, the copper to the brass fitting, screw the brass fitting down, and then you need to do the torque spec that comes with the unit. Each um, different size of copper will have a different size torque spec and you just need to torque them to that torque. And if you've done everything we've just gone through, you shouldn't have a leak. So that was making a flare. If you like the content of the video, please like and subscribe and share with your friends. If you have any questions, drop them in the comments.